Hi, this is Shelley Kraft. We're coming to you live on SNN Live. We're at the 2011 New Orleans Investment Conference. I have Chuck Provini of Natcor Technology NXT on the TSX Venture. Chuck, welcome back Thank to SNN nice Live. To good you. to see you. How good are to, you? Good to see you. Glad to be back. So, uh, give me an update. Well, what Natcor has done over the last year is we've become much closer to commercialization. We've actually built a machine that will help us apply the anti-reflective coatings that we put on solar cells. And we're actually testing that machine and optimizing it at our new lab at Rochester in the Kodak, Eastman Kodak Labs. Uh, we think we're going to actually have this machine in somebody's uh, production line, probably in China and or Italy, uh, in the first quarter of this year. So now, give us a rundown. What does it actually do? Well, without getting too technical, we grow stuff on stuff. We grow thin layers of a variety of uh, coatings on a variety of surfaces. What we're doing this first with, though, is in the solar industry. So right now, no matter how you make a solar cell, at some point you have to put an anti-reflective coating on it so you don't reflect the sun, so you absorb it. We're putting that coating on, and we do it differently because in the industry now they use high-level very intense furnaces. We do it by putting it in a bathtub at room temperature and at uh, ambient normal pressures. So it sounds like an interesting business. What's the size of that industry, do you think? Uh, well, the, the size of the industry depends on where, where you are, whether you're in the United States or whether you're in Europe. In Europe, it's much, much bigger. An example of why it's important in our technology, though, is w just the electric savings, the amount of electric we save by inserting one of our machines will save a customer in Italy $1.2 million only in their electric bill. Well, it has to be a, like a manufacturing facility or a large uh, residence of some kind, right? It would be a manufacturing facility. It wouldn't be. It, these are people who make solar cells or our customers. Got it. So now why are you at uh, an investment conference for resources? Well, mostly because um, uh, we had our beginnings at this conference. Uh, many of our shareholders are here. Uh, we have a very passionate group of shareholders that we come to visit uh, once a year. And New Orleans is a good place to hang out. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad. So you're actually, quote unquote, a green company in a, to a large extent. Yes, absolutely. We're a... Uh, we are a green company at a variety of levels. We're, we're, we're working to make solar energy work in the United States or in the world for the first time. Uh, we're a green company because we reduce the toxic emissions that um, uh, solar energy has during the manufacturing. Um, we're a green company because we just save a lot of money on electricity costs in the manufacturing process. So you've got to be a favorite of the Obama administration. Who? Uh, <laughs> last time I checked, he was still president. <laughs> we, we have actually been invited to the White House uh, because they saw some deals we did in China. Uh, we went there, and to be very candid, uh, they, they, they were interesting, they were pleasant, uh, but our, our administration, our country, has just uh, put solar energy on the back burner for a while. I know it's in there somewhere in their planning. <laughs> anyway, what is your website? Uh, our website is uh, natcoresolar.com. Okay, natcoresolar.com. Chuck Provini, symbol NXT on the TSX Venture. I want to thank you for coming on. Thank you again. Good to see you again.